Hi everyone, thank you for joining me. I am making a video all about my favorite thing, which is tea. And um, I did put out a uh, poll or asking some questions on um, what you'd like me to share this spring. And um, the number one thing was talking about my selection of teas. So I am delighted <laughs> to share that with you. It's one of my favorite things, so yeah. I will be going through my favorite teas again. I'm so excited. I've been wanting to do this video or these videos for so long. And finally, um, I'm going to be going through uh, my selection. So this one I'm excited about. I'm going to go through my favorite, my top five favorite teas for spring. It's the Wittard tea. So this is the um, orange blossom really really lovely tea here this is a loose leaf tea and this one is great because it's actually um fragrance with um orange and citrus notes so very light and refreshing perfect for spring i mean why not it's absolutely lovely so this is a black tea i'm, I'm going to show you so this is the wittard tea and I am going to show you how it comes in the package. So I'm going to actually unbox it for you so you have a better idea. So it comes in a bag like this and um, it's all loose leaf black tea. I'll just show you the petals here and the, the leaves, the tea leaves, just there. You can get a look at that. I don't know if you can actually see, but um, that's the loose leaf tea there and like I said this is a black tea and it has some orange petals in there and orange peel you will see me always drinking something with a rose in it and this is oh, this is like my all-time favorite rose teas like oh my goodness it's it's so beautiful I, I, I can't even I, I have to just open it up for you so you can have a look well I just want to smell it quickly. <laughs> it's so beautiful. And I just love the tin. The tin is so pretty and, and feminine. I really like it. It's so pretty. Um, this is my favorite, favorite, favorite blends by Harrods. Again, this is a black tea. This is a fragrance tea. And it is uh, fragranced with um, rose. And it has some rose petals in there. So it's very pretty. And like I said before, the tin is absolutely beautiful. So I'll show you what that looks like close up. So that's the rose there. <laughs> there we go. So you can see it's a black loose leaf tea. Um, and that has some pretty pink petals. I'm going to show you is slightly different it's a mixture of teas this one is a green tea it's mixed green tea and black tea and um, it's actually peppermint so it's black tea and um, peppermint and it also has some notes of bergamot as well which is the same ingredient you would find in your Earl Grey and it's this is mixed with mint tea so this is by another favourite of mine, so that's Mirage Frey, I don't know if you can see that there, but um, yeah, this is a really nice tea. This is called Casablanca. If you could smell how fragrant this is, it's, it's beautiful, it's so, so nice and rich, like you really get that scent of mint and the citrus notes and it's just so well blended together it's really really delightful it's different like take on a peppermint tea because it's mixed with uh, citrus and also um, green I think some green and black teas as well and that's quite pretty you can see there in the tin how that looks there so that's a really nice tea and even though I was saying earlier that it's spring, 
um, and then you normally go for like lighter teas during this month um, but still you want something warming because during springtime the weather is not that settled and you know one minute it's freezing cold the next minute it's bright and sunny beautiful blue skies then it's pouring down with rain so sometimes you just want something that is you know still warming and this is my um, another go-to mint tea if I'm going to have a mint tea it would be this one here that's loose leaf it's really nice it's called Casablanca when you smell this tea it's like nothing you've smelled before honestly you really get that peppermint oil it's beautiful that's really nice I have to show you one of my favorites. <laughs> so this here is also by Wittard. There, if you can see that there, that's the view. So this is a Wittard tea again, and this is the cherry blossom. Again, the fragrance from this tea is like no other. When it comes to spring, I would say I have to have a cup of cherry blossom. It has such a sweet, delicate flavour and aroma. Like the scent is very warming and, you know, fun as well. It's really like sweet and lovely. It's like a true cherry flavour and it's packaged in bag like that and you can just see already how pretty um, those leaves are isn't it it's really pretty uh, this is such a good tea so now coming back to spring the reason why I picked this tea up is because it's a green tea <laughs> and green teas are ideal for any time to be honest with you but I love my green teas during the spring and the cherry blossom Oh my gosh again <laughs> when you open up this packaging you just get this um you know whiff of sweet cherries like warm sweet cherries and like i said it's very fun and sweet very it's so nice it's really really nice and i think also um it's got sort of like a perfume to it so that's one of my go-to spring teas can you see how pretty i told you <laughs> It's such a pretty, pretty tea. Look how good, look how vivid the roses are against the, the green leaves. It's really, really nice. Yeah, so this is ideal for, for springtime. One of my favorites. And then I have another favorite of mine. It's the Countess Grey by Fortnum's. And this tea is my favorite <laughs> this is my favorite one i'll show you here it's the countess gray by fortnum and masons and it's presented in this lovely tin um i can show you the contents inside again so if this tea here is a this is a black tea and this tea is uh, flavored with citrus notes again so it's like an orange blossom or orange citrus flavor. And this is such a nice tea. Now, this tea, I would say, um, it's a black tea. So I would definitely have this with milk. I would serve this with milk. My favorite spring teas. So um, thank you so much for watching. Um, I've got so much more to share with you all, but thank you so much for watching my first tea video. I hope you enjoyed it and um, please like my video if you liked it <laughs> and if you don't like it, maybe like it <laughs> or maybe like the others, I don't know, but please like and subscribe. Thank you.